The president in the disaster zone tonight under pressure to visit communities affected by the deadly floods in Louisiana. President Obama consoling families getting a firsthand look at the devastation. More than 60,000 homes damaged or destroyed. The president criticized for waiting more than a week since the floods hit. Donald Trump, who went four days earlier today, tweeting, too little, too late. ABC's Philip Mena in Louisiana tonight, where the president said this should not be about politics. Tonight, President Obama reassuring the victims of the Louisiana flood. What I want the people of Louisiana to know is that you're not alone on this, even after the TV cameras leave. Touring the devastation, he met with officials and residents, dismissing criticism for not cutting his vacation in Martha's Vineyard short last week. Give me a good, strong guy here. Donald Trump <laughs> visited four days ago. Obama ought to get off the golf course and get down there. The president saying today it's not about politics. Nobody gives a hoot whether you're a Democrat or Republican. Uh, what they care about is making sure they're getting the... Uh, the drywall out. The drywall is already out at Carl Stewart Jr.'s home in Denham Springs. He says it's about time the president showed up. You're our president. You should be here, you know, getting things moving. With a FEMA inspector assessing his damage, Stewart's neighbor, Michael Howell, says anything that keeps the spotlight here is good. As long as they're here, that's all that matters. I don't think the time frame really matters. David, more than 110,000 people have asked for FEMA assistance. Officials estimate it'll take three months just to clean up all of this debris. And schools here are delaying opening till next month. David? Philip Mena. Philip, thank you.